Good morning YouTube. In this video, I'm going to show you what to do when your phone is full. It's a terrible experience when uh, all the storage on your Android phone is used up. There are many ways you can make space again by cleaning out uh, crap that you don't need on your phone. You can do it manually by uh, going into uh, storage and it'll tell you here what what is taking up space so on this phone right now this is a 16 gig samsung galaxy s5 and you can see uh, almost all the storage is used up i have less than one gig available so this causes all kinds of problems once it fills up you're not able to update apps and obviously you can't uh, take pictures and video anymore because all your storage is used up so you can go in to eat into each item like this you can say uh, let's go to use space and then this will tell you how much space is being used by applications how much is being used by pictures and videos how much is being used by audio so then you can go into each one individually and you can uh, delete photos and video you can remove apps that you don't like and so on wandering all over your phone looking for apps to delete is inconvenient it's uh, way easier if you have an app that shows you in one place all the files you can delete. Here are the types of files uh, we're going to delete. Number one, junk files. These are uh, temporary files, cache files, and uh, files that apps uh, use to hold data. These are all files we can qu quickly delete to recover some much needed space. Second, we're going to delete media files. These are the big files that take up the most space on your phone. These would include uh, photos, videos, podcasts, maybe movies you downloaded, and so on. And thirdly, are apps. There may be uh, apps that you no longer need or you haven't used in a long time, and those can be deleted too. So we're going to use an app called Clean Master to delete these types of files so that we can free up storage on the phone. What's the advantage of using one app? Well, it's just easier to do everything from one spot. That's the main advantage. The end result is exactly the same. You're just deleting files to free up space on the phone. Since a lot of the photos and videos that are taking up valuable space on your phone, you don't want to actually delete permanently. You want to back it up somehow. This can also be done in many ways, but my preferred method is to use cloud storage specifically Google Plus and Dropbox. So first I'm going to sh quickly show you how we set up automatic backup of photos. Then I'm going to download Clean Master and use it to delete all these types of files. Uh, it's very easy to set up. To set up Google Plus, you can just go into Google Plus, click on Photos. You can click on Settings then. Auto Backup, Backup Settings. So you can set it up that you can back up photos whenever there is a Wi-Fi connection available. And if you set your photo size to standard size, you can keep backing up your photos to your Google account and Google doesn't charge you anything extra for that. That's a pretty good idea because then you can, uh, e first of all, even if you, delete, if you delete pictures, it doesn't matter because they're already backed up. So you can delete photos whenever you want. And also if you lose your phone, it doesn't matter because, well, at least if you, it matters if you lose your phone, but at least your photos are backed up and your videos and things like that. So that's the first thing you want to do uh, is keep your photos backed up automatically. That way you can delete them whenever you want. I also use Dropbox to do that and it works sort of the same way. You can go into Dropbox. You can go into settings. And you can set camera upload. You can turn it on and off and if you keep it on it'll keep backing up your photos and videos and you can tell it whether you want to just back up photos just back up videos and so on so once you do that then it makes it easy when space fills up you can first off right off the top del delete your photos and videos easily so let's go and get clean master clean master phone boost by Cheetah Mobile. So we're going to install that application. 
Okay, Clean Masker is installed. So let's open it. So as you can see on this phone, 93% of my storage is used. So let's start removing files so we can bring that number down. Okay, let's press the junk files button to start. It's gonna go through the device and identify various uh, cache files, data files, other uh, temporary files that we can uh, quickly remove. So let's go ahead and press the clean junk button. Okay, that's done. Now let's go into advanced cleaning. Search for large files on the device. Search. So this is what I like. It shows you in one spot all the different big files and then you can kind of manually decide what you want and what you don't want. So I don't need that, so we'll select that. Select select there's some big video files we can get rid of all that so because everything's backed up to uh, to my Google Plus and Dropbox I'm not too concerned about deleting off the phone I know they're uh, safe elsewhere and I can access them even from my phone anytime I want some re residual files Okay, so we're gonna clean all that. So to use this, you wanna know beforehand that these are files that you're okay with deleting. All this app is really doing is letting you delete them all from one place. Now we go to the app manager section of the app. So th these are ads in essence, what they're doing here is just asking you while you're deleting apps, if you want to add in any, any more apps, which I mean, I guess they have to make money from their advertising. Now from this screen, from the app manager screen, we can in one shot, remove all the apps that we don't need anymore. These are all apps I don't use anymore. So we can uninstall all that. <laughs> Okay, we have removed apps that we no longer need. We have uh, deleted the big uh, media files that we uh, don't need on the phone anymore that we've backed up. We've removed cache files and now only 29% of the space is used on the phone. We freed up a lot of space now. So now we can go back to enjoying the phone, taking pictures freely, downloading new things and so on. Okay, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and press that like button. Also, remember to subscribe to the channel for more videos and let me know in the comments if you end up using this app and how it goes for you. As well as any other how-to videos you would like to see in the future as I work on expanding the AGN TV channel. Thank you for watching.